morning, beautiful people, and welcome to my channel from Pancakes to Peach. Let's jump right into this video. this morning about to get in the shower you can hear the shower runner water running now gonna wash my face brush my teeth and just jump right into it but before I start my day like I said I'm getting surgery on June 9th at Avana plastic surgery with Dr. Meniscus and I have to keep my body healthy like I said in the last video so gotta take these vitamins they are up here. Um, we went over them in the last video. Uh, you can check out the last video for more information on the pineapple juice and the vitamins. But I put all my vitamins in this uh, peel organizer so it's easier for me to take them. And then um, after that, I come in and get my body cleaned and I'm out the door. Uh, today I'm actually working from home though. And then I have a doctor's appointment after work um, to get my blood work done. And I'm so excited about the blood work. Like I cannot wait. Hope this hemoglobin is 100 because my friend, her stuff was not right. And she's going to have to pay an extra $550 if her hemoglobin doesn't come up for surgery. She's going to have to purchase a cell saver. So that's why I said taking that iron is very important for your hemoglobin. But um, I'm going to show you guys. I'm going to try to get some footage at the doctor um, just to show you guys, you know, what's going on there. And then I was going to take this sports bra back to Walmart, but it's looking doing the job so this might be a keeper but uh I'll um show you guys what I'm packing as well so that's why I'm going to Walmart to pick up some more stuff for the packing video um but stay tuned for the rest of my day to see what I got going on all right, fresh out the shower. Now I'm going to try to get some work done in my makeup studio slash guest room slash office. I say I got a makeup studio after like two weeks of trying to do my own makeup. A girl got to do what she got to do. Don't be hating. Got to be fly after this BBL. Can't be no basic. So this is my brunch, guys. I kind of skipped breakfast this morning, so I'm going to eat breakfast and lunch together today. Um, just honey oat toast with sausage and boiled eggs. I didn't put any butter on the toast, and I didn't put any salt on the boiled eggs, and I eat it just like this, like a sandwich, and then um, with a good old-fashioned H2O. So um, stay healthy, guys. Eat good, balanced meals um, that's going to give you some type of nutrition. Um, don't starve yourself, but because you still need um, food, but definitely exercise and keep doing all this other great stuff. I have a diet book coming that I'm going to do a video about losing 10 pounds before surgery. So we can do that together. It's going to be the JJ Smith um, green smoothie cleanse. So order your book now and then we can do it together. Hey guys, I'm on my way to the doctor now to get my labs. I just got off work and of course I'm rushing to get down here. Like it never fails, I tell you, but I'm on my way. We gonna make the best of it. I'm going to get these labs done. Hopefully I'll be in and out. Um, got my mask because you know, now with this whole pandemic thing, you're required up oh, safety first. Let me put on my seatbelt. I'm rushing. But luckily, I live down the street. So, anywho, um, got my mask. So, um, that's our new normal now. So, make sure when you guys are out, um, you have a mask on because you cannot afford to get sick before surgery. I know I can't. So, I'm going to be on the table regardless. Just put me under. But, yeah. So, almost at the doctor. I'll let you guys know how it is when I get there. So I get to the doctor rushing. I'm already late and these people waiting for me before I can even go upstairs. They have to take my temperature because of COVID-19 and all this pandemic stuff. Look at that lady looking at me in the picture. Like she saw me snapping a picture and I'm like, sorry, I'm documenting my journey. So the lady tried to take my temperature a few times. It kept reading 94 and she was like, I can't let you upstairs to your temperature at least 97.7. I said, what? Which I don't even know how my temperature was reading that low when I definitely was sweating and rushing to get down the street. But anywho, she took it behind the ear. It came up to temp and then they let me go upstairs to the doctor. So in the lobby of the doctor's office and they have it marked off and sectioned off. So I guess you're social distancing and six feet apart from each other. Okay, so they're actually going to do my EKG in the doctor's office, which is great. I didn't know. So 
hopefully um, it goes well. She said they're having problems with the internet. So I hope that the internet is working today and I get to get my EKG. Um, my blood pressure was up. What the fuck? I hope my shit come down. Like I can't afford to get my surgery canceled because of my blood pressure. Oh, I'm recording. I hope you don't mind. I'm making a YouTube like, oh. documentary about it. Okay. <laughs> so. Sometimes they don't do them if you're under like 40 or 50, but it all depends on the surgeon. Apparently I answered a question about my thyroid, oh. so that's why they want it. And you don't take any thyroid medication? No, I had my parathyroid removed okay. a couple years ago because my body was producing too much calcium. Okay. And uh, they took it all out. I haven't had any so maybe symptoms. that's why your heart rate's up and your blood pressure's up a little bit. I don't know. I'll find out. I said she's going to do blood work on you too, so. share this with you guys I brought a notebook yes the notebook has all of the pictures of me I'm conceited and I love myself um, to write down questions and answers and stuff like that I may have for the doctor then I also have a folder with all my important information that I brought with me so um, it's good to stay organized through this whole process So I'm getting my blood drawn now, and then um, I'll explain the labs to you guys, uh, which, what each of them mean. Um, when she explained them to me, I'm thinking some of these are more specific to me, um, just because I used to have thyroid problems or something. So you guys may not have to get all these thyroid labs like I did. Well, in that case, I'll do a separate video with all my results, and then I'll explain the labs in that video, what each of them mean. Well, I guess that kind of went well, except my blood pressure wanted to be acting all fucking funny and shit. Excuse my language but now off to um walmart to pick up this stuff for the upcoming packing video 
Like the weather in Cincinnati sucks. Like why is it raining and cold in May? Like I just don't understand. Yes, I'm in a handicap. Y'all don't know my handicap. I'm about to have surgery out here. All right, just pulled up to Wally World. I'm about to go in here and pick up this online order so I can show y'all all the shit I bought for this video that I'm gonna be taking with me to get this new peach. All right, guys, this concludes today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. Until next time, like, share, subscribe, and comment. Follow me on Instagram, and I'll see you guys later.